Good morning, friends, and welcome to Tuesday, January 3rd. Harold Durfee will start us with Star Child. <laughs> Tuesday's devotion is found in the Upper Room Discipline, written by Douglas Powell, Jr. And our scripture reading is Isaiah 42, 8-9. I am the Lord, that is my name, my glory I give to no other, nor my praise to idols. See, the former things have come to pass, and new things I now declare. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. We've all heard the phrase, talk the talk and walk the walk. What we cannot stand, what we say cannot stand alone, but we must back it up with what we do. The author loves these verses in Isaiah because God is saying, look, I talk the talk and I also walk the walk. All of you need for proof of me. All you need for proof of my faithfulness in the future is to look at my faithfulness in the past. What do people see when they look at the former actions of our denominations or congregations or those representing Christianity? Do they see us simply talking a good game or are we walking the walk? The author is not naive and he does not expect us to exist in a utopia. He does believe that if we are honest, we will admit that we do a better job of talking the talk than walking the walk. It's easy for us to point out the faults and misgivings of others while ignoring the ways we are not living into our own discipleship. It is the author's dream to live in a way that makes this text come alive. He prays that when he talks, others will be willing to listen because they know the former things that he has done. This does not mean that he'll get it right every time, but he will strive for that and hope to succeed enough times to establish a body of work. Michael Jordan did not hit every last second shot he took as a pro, but his body of work for winning every NBA final he played in speaks for itself. What would others see if our body of work truly backed up what we said in terms of mercy, justice, and love? Do they, the authors, thinks that they would see heaven here on earth? Let us pray. All seeing God, may our words and our actions help others to see you. May we talk the talk and walk the walk as Christians. Amen. Our closing hymn is Ferris Lord Jesus, verse 4. <laughs> 